Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, I am Docs and this is a Bite or Not mini, rev mini review series. Today I was browsing my uh, Steam uh, store page and I saw in the new releases se section there was a game called Why So Evil. Since I, I'm, I, I, I'm a fan of Batman and uh, <laughs> why so and, and the Why So Serious Joker phrase. I thought, okay, let's take a look. What, what, what? How can it hurt? So I started reading about the game, and I actually really like what the developers were saying in the description. So this is one of those hardcore games. That is like the one they used to make when I was a kid, for example, that did not allow you to save for like 45 minutes, maybe an hour and a half, if it was a really tough game that uh, didn't tell you much they just need needed to figure out everything take a piece of paper and write down everything that you found out in the game and so on another thing they wrote there was dlcs and uh, custom packs and such no there won't be any those are called updates and if i remember correctly that's how they used to be a long time ago so you actually got the whole content of the game and you paid a bunch of money for it and then afterwards they just kept refining it and adding adding more content just to keep the player base happy and get them to buy the next game now you pay like premium 60 dollars 60 euros depends on the game and then you need to be, to to fork out another 20 40 60 euros to get the DLC content and the skin packs and the custom gun skins and stuff like that. So yeah, ah, whatever. But let's get back to our game right here. So this is the first try. They say that this game will kill you, whatever you do. And uh, since I'm a fan of games that do that, but they need to do that in a, in a way that they first allow you to learn the game and every time you play it you become better at it I have uh, done a review uh, not a review I have done a buy it or not mini review for a game called accidental runner a little while ago and my problem with that game was that it was too hard so I, I didn't really know what exactly and how I was supposed to play it I just died and yeah I, I, I don't really like that kind of stuff. So let's see if this game does does better than that. So W A S D. Oh, oh wow. So this one has inertia. So it doesn't so if I press longer it goes faster. Oh man, so this looks so I'm not sure exactly what I need to do here. Let's try and get past the other side okay not sure. oh so I need to to no not that just go let's go closer and one okay come back no step sit 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 there don't now move, run, 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 run to the snowman. Kick him out of the... No, what the... Come on. Push him away. Yes. And... No. <laughs> well, this is fun. Okay, so... Let's see if I... Okay, I got to... Oh, so I need to... Oh, but it, I did not get the diamond. There was a diamond beneath the snowman. Run, run, run. Ah, got it. Okay, so now I need to be sneaky. Can't I? No, I can't jump. Okay. Okay. No, 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 
No, no, no, no, no. Can't. Come on. The first stage, really? <laughs> oh. No. Okay, so. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, well, see, this game wants me to. Make, makes me want to try again. So it doesn't it doesn't uh, frustrate me in a bad way. It frustrates me in a good way. So I actually want to 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 be able to beat this game. It's not not a flappy bird, flappy flap, flappy bird bird or birds, whatever. Not a clone of a game like that that makes you makes you angry just for playing it. This this here you need a little skill. You need not just twitch your reflexes. You need to think think about how you will do this. Thing that you like, nah. <laughs> not no, no, nah, ignore me, not not like that. No, that was not the way to do it. But this, this is this, this, yeah, okay. So let's push this snowman out of the way. Come on, come on, you pipe smoker, move it, move it, and come on. Okay, I, I need to, yes, topple, topple, yeah, come on. Come on. <laughs> Yeah, baby, come on, that's it. Diamonds, yes, diamonds. Okay, so easy now. Yep, stop, 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 and run. Yes, that's it. Okay, so how do we deal with this? Mm, do they? Have the same length? Yes, I think they do. Let's move a little bit closer. Can I one one step? Yes, I can. <laughs> no, darn. Okay, okay. No, no worries. No worries. Okay. Okay, so... 50 levels, eh? Okay, this is going to take a while. But... I'm not going to bore you all with my ineptitude and my lack of skill. So, what can I say about this game? I got it for 2.5 euros on Steam, that's 3 dollars, I think. Uh, it's on 50% sale at the moment, so its price is 5 euros, 6, 50, 7 dollars. But I think that it's if if all the levels all the levels are uh, are as nicely made, and I I'm guessing that as we progress through the game, the levels and the and the and the strategies you need to, the tactics you need to come up with to get past these red cubes or whatever other other um, obstacles they put in front of you, we need to get uh, much more advanced. Then I think that this price, especially the 2.5 euros that I paid, are well. I I think I think I'm going to to get a couple of more and uh, give them out to a few of my uh, my friends. Just to to see them <laughs> struggle with it <laughs> and have a laugh. So what can I can say, I, I I really I really enjoy seeing uh, seeing games like these. That uh, I'm not sure. I need I need to go and read up about who made this game. If it was a small studio or one person or stuff like that, I really like when people actually make small games like this and actually put put a lot of thought and and, and make and make a polished final product. Because uh, I've complained in the previous video also that uh, a lot of of uh, games that actually get crowd crowdfunded for a lot of money uh, actually end up releasing very poor end content. Final the final content is very poor because once they get funded, the developers say, like, "Ah, okay, we've got the money, we've got the time, no need to to." Go about and really put our our uh, passion into this. So I like it when people actually be. It doesn't have to be a huge game. It can be something smaller, like this, for example. I'm I'm really happy to pay the 
the money that it costs to to be able to play it because this is a game that is okay you can go okay let's have a have a go you know you, you you probably i will probably maybe make it to level 10 but that if i'm lucky and i'm well rested and so on but uh, it's a game that you can go okay let's let's have a few levels that in the end you learn the levels maybe go up and maybe then when you when you've reached level 50 and you're like yes i beat the game they say okay here's your free dlc that we call an update another 10 levels with increased difficulty of course no but of course or here you go we'll add a little more weight to one side of your cube but you won't be able to tell which, to tell which side by any visual you just need to move the, cu the cube first to realize that and or maybe other cool stuff like that so what can i say this game looks promising and it looks like something that will eat a lot of time for a lot of people so go on steam get the game get frustrated by the game and enjoy it at the same time i am docs this is a buy into or not mini review series i wish that all of you have an awesome day bye bye